100 women can have 100 different experiences. Look at this picture. Some people may have the image that pregnancy and birthing can be a joyous event, but others may have a fear of childhood, anxiety, and depression. What causes differences? No one knows when birthing starts, how it proceeds, how much pain there will be, or whether the baby can be born without complications. And even if we have the same experiences, many of those experiences may change depending on how we perceive it and where we focus our attention. I recommend you try mindfulness. Just as stress coping ideas have been adapted from traditional Buddhism into clinical psychology, Mindfulness has become one of the increasingly popular preventive and therapeutic approaches. In my research program, Mindful Bursting, I recommend they focus on feeling the baby's movement while using breathing meditation so that their body and mind change in that moment. Towards that end, my unique practice is ice practice. We hold ice cubes for one more minute while changing our attitude towards the cold pain. For example, breathing while dealing with the ice as a toy with a smile and imagining a baby. Depending on one's attitude, our body sensation can drastically change. And also, you can be aware that the pain of childbirth can help you and not hurt you and is not your enemy. Mindfulness can help you understand the experience you are facing. Then you can take a more gentle approach filled with curiosity and be aware that there is no need to avoid or fight any situation. You can hug them all the same as a new joy, happiness, or get in your life. I'm okay. Everything's going well for me. I can love these challenges. Pass mindfully with your babies and families to savor the precious baby's growth. Live mindfully to savor your life beyond any life events. One day, mindfulness may become your pocketable lifelong tools can help you anywhere and anytime.